It's been said that Anclote is the perfect spot for paranormal activity. It was originally home to the Native Americans and a burial ground has been discovered here. There are many cemeteries here. These cemeteries include Anclote Cemetery and a cemetery which has been lost and built over and a mass grave of unknown African Americans. It is also rumored that Anclote has been the site of numerous hangings added to its dark and bloody past. Anclote has many ghost stories. Probably the most famous of all is the ghost of Cindy. Cindy is an attractive blonde girl in 80s attire and the victim of an extreme brutality and can be seen wandering Anclote Road. Through many EVPs, a girl's spirit comes through identifying herself as Cindy. Cindy was beaten, raped, and murdered by four men somewhere in the nearby wooded area. Motorists have reportedly seen an attractive woman running naked through the woods, matching her physical description. Another spirit that is in the area is that of a hobo off of Calvary Road. This spirit is more often smelled than seen. He emits an odor much like stale human male sweat mixed with sour musty clothing. He likes to follow people walking down the street giving a feeling of brushing into spider webs when he is close to you. A piece of advice many receive when either moving to or visiting Anclote, stay out of Anclote Cemetery if you know what's good for you. Multiple people have said that a great deal of very nasty spirits have made the old cemetery their home. Another small girl believed to be about 12 who is known to sing or count as if she is playing hide and seek. She has also heard calling out for her mommy. Tom is a man who claims to have been hung in the early 1900s in the woods near Anclote Cemetery, given credibility to the claims of hangings in the area. He has been heard on Spirit Box EVPs saying, up here, I'm up here. Jax is an older male who has been seen within a four block radius of Anclote. This spirit is not nice and he has been known to terrorize women. Now sit back and get ready for an exciting time at the Anclote Cemetery. And let's see what ghostesses we can find right into the dark. Keep your eyes and ears open. Let me know in the comments below what you saw, what you heard, Anything I might have missed. Let's go explore the cemetery. What's up everyone? Today we are at Anclote Cemetery. We got in here before dark. I am here with Thomas. Ventures and Vlogs with Thomas. I have Henriette in front of me. Um, she's going to kind of be our bodyguard. And um, we are going to take you out into this cemetery. We do have flowers. Um, we're going to put out in a few places. And Henriette has the um, angels that she's going to put out in a few places. Hi. So um, let's get into this video. Out there? Yeah. Oh, I do hear people. All right. I know the first flower I want to put out is down okay. here. All right, guys, we're taking you out. We are going to go right into the dark. We seen, we seen somebody back there, guys. And then Thomas walked back there and Thomas found a, Thomas found a clown thing. What was it, Thomas? It's a, neck a clown thing. A neck that you would wear if you were, this is shadow yeah, if you were dressed up as a clown. That's crazy. Is that a shadow people? We're by that tree. No. Is it somebody? I don't know. The trail goes back this way. I walked it one time with Joe. Um, 
and it goes back that way. But if you, the person we saw, you don't, you didn't see where they went. No, there's, I don't see any place where they could go. Well, the trail goes way down that way, so I don't know where they went. But I know that people were living in the um, woods. Come on, Henriette, let's put some flowers over here. I wonder if Glenda's been able to come out. Look how gorgeous that is. Oh. Where is it at? It's back here. Looks like Glenda's been here. Yep. Hello. This is Glenda's mama. Oh, look, they got all kinds of pretty flowers here. Come in. This is John's mom. They got a lot of flowers. So maybe we should put some of the flowers at other places. I'm going to put one here. <laughs> Aw. Glenda's probably been out here because, um, Oh, you're going to put the... I was going to say, I hear somebody back there. Here, hold these. Got them? Yeah. Look. We brought you some flowers and some hearts and angels. I hope you rest in peace. All right, and then look up in there. There's graves all up in there. But we wanted to put flowers and stuff here. They got, like, you can rope off your loved ones, but you, then you have to be the one to take care of it. So, um, if you're going to rope it off, you got to make sure that somebody's going to come take care of it. Look at this, all the old flowers that they put in there. Look at the angel. They put all their old flowers here. They got it really pretty. I wanted to go see Glenda today, guys, and I just didn't make it. Huh? I know. They have a lot of loved ones and a lot of flowers, so we'll put the flowers where, where there is none. I see that. And the radio like daddy. Oh, that radio is almost like daddy's. Yeah. Oh, wow. Samuel. He died in 1998. I have a radio similar to that, guys. That was my daddy's. Wow. U.S. Navy, thank you for your service. Oh, you're going to put the angel there? Okay. Oh, okay. Put some flowers there, too. Just put one set of flowers there. We just had a few flowers in the car, guys. We, we decided we were going to put a few flowers out here. Look, I'm hearing people out in the woods. I'm hearing people screaming. They're at both directions. I'm hearing them at this end, too. We're going to have to be careful once it gets dark. Oh, there's people over there, too, that I think that are hearing me because they just in the woods. Rest in peace, Samuel. Are they not I know. I've seen that. This right here. I don't know if it's new. Can we see a year? My eyes are not good enough. I think it's 2021. No, it's, what is the date on this, Henriette? That one's 2021. What's the date on this one? Oh, okay. Wow, I really like that. That's the, that's really pretty. Oh.
Look at these lights over here. Wonder what they mean. There's a grave up there by the tree too. A Catholic prayer light. Is that what it is? Uh -huh. oh. Look at this. Wow. That is awesome. I guess they couldn't afford a tombstone at the time because they have this and somebody made those. Jessica Marie, mother, daughter, and friend. Aw. Give her the pink flowers. Where do I put them? Put them um, by the nameplate right here. Like right behind the nameplate. Yeah. There you, there you go. Awesome. All right. Nana. Mm -hmm. Look at the pink bench. Oh, it's so cute. It is cute. It is cute. It's is it a baby? Cute. The mother comes and sits. I don't like to focus on babies. 2015 to 2020. A five year old child. Oh, I'm so sorry. Wow. There's some right down in here, too. Look at that. I know. That's cool. I can't see people. What's Look this? Look at those ones. Those are kind I know. They sure do. Wow. Sarah. Sarah Thompson. 1850. Oh, 1947. Aww. That's 1921. Yeah. Why don't you give Sarah the pink flowers? Is that the last one? Yeah. Push more in the car, though. Aww. This is Joseph. 1850 to 1921. Oh, wow. Like yeah. Look at this, guys. These are probably really old. They're probably all really old up in here. These are probably some of the first ones. Look at that one, guys just about to get dark. Wow. Look at those up in there. They're falling over. That's sad. This one here. Looks like somebody tried to clean it with something. Why is there flowers in the woods? I don't know. Somebody threw it away. Somebody littered. Don't pick up the stuff. What are you doing? Egg. Yeah, I don't think it's flowers. Um, to any of you guys out there, when you go to your loved one's grave and you bring new flowers, take the old flowers and put them on a grave that doesn't have any flowers. Some of these graves, if you look around, some of these graves probably haven't seen flowers for years and years and years. What? Is that? what? I guess it's a tombstone. What does it say? Look, it looks like a pole that somebody put in the ground. It's somebody. It's somebody's tombstone. They couldn't afford it, so they got a big old. Is it there in the Navy or something? It was obviously just put here. What does it say? It's hard to read it. 
It does say it something. something. Bug. Bud. Tote mate. The mate pay. Russell Lee. Wilson. Yeah. Russell Lee. Wilson. Oh wow. They couldn't afford a tombstone, so they put it on there. Maybe they're It'll Indian, stay. And that's like their powwow pole. No, I don't know. But there's names all the way around it. And I don't remember this being here before, guys. So this is new. This is really new. Did you just hear that? Yes, I did. Oh, wow. Sounds like a chainsaw. <laughs> when it gets dark, guys, I'm making you guys a separate video. And um, I'm just going to do a... Gonna mainly do a walk through. Henriette's gonna be our, our lookout. Because there is people out there in the woods. Alright guys, I'm gonna do a little bit of spirit box right back here. I don't know how much I'm gonna be able to do after dark. Because we're gonna have to worry about the people coming in um, from the woods. I know that we had issues one other time with people coming in from the woods. All right, I'm going to set you up right here. Oops, maybe. All right. And we are going to try to do some spirit pop. And we have Go around the other side and see who these two graves belong to. Um, yeah. Just, just don't walk too on the graves. Walk along the side or up the middle. All right, guys. Here goes the spirit box. What's the name? James and Selena. Jacks. James and Selena. Owen, okay. Okay. Fantastic. Fantastic. We are at the grave site of James and Selena and Owen. Any spirits come through and talk with us? My name is Marie. You come in peace. Tell me what your name is. closed in here. As soon as we die, do we go to heaven? thing is tribulation. Can you tell me when is Jesus coming back for the rest of us? Does anyone know, or is it just going to be a surprise?
Can you show yourself in my camera? Thank you for talking with us. Do you get many visitors? Thank you for talking with us. Can you tell us why? You're shy? Bye. Ooh, something stinks. Did you hear that? <laughs> Bye. Talking about. Said something stinks or something. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what it said. Something about something stinks. Alright guys. Henriette is putting these little hearts on this grave. And she's got one over here too. This side of the cemetery, it's just about to be dark. I was gonna walk you up this side in the dark. I think this, is the this one's all roped oh. off. Yeah, it might be like a baby land. No. I should have saved this front half for dark <laughs> to keep me away from them woods. I don't know where Thomas went. That grave way back there is all lit up. See it back there, guys? Now we just have to worry about somebody coming in the cemetery. You guys got a good view, but it's actually pretty dark. Before we know it, it's going to be real dark. I hear somebody back there. I see a light. And we had to see a light over there. And I hear somebody. I hear people screaming. You got my strong flashlight. That might be some kids. There's a house over there. I was hearing stuff back here. And this is where this is where the woods are. Alright guys, I am going to get ready for my nighttime video. Shadow people everywhere. All right, guys, I'm going to get ready for my night video. I hope you enjoyed this video. Peace.